Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Ace Combat 6. We're on Mission 8, San Noma Assault, Under a Sky of Fire. Yep, that's what this one's called. I'm a bit tired so I apologize if the commentary is weird, but I want to get this done and out to you guys because it's a then fun I'll give game. You the lowdown and here's mission. the briefing. Oh Small boy. Small unmanned aerial vehicles, cruise missiles, and heavy command cruisers are all closely related in terms of functionality and have been uncovered as the enemy's secret weapons by our analysis results. We have collected missile and small unmanned aerial vehicle samples, as well as radar records, analyzed them, and came up with the following. First of all, the small unmanned aerial vehicles are operated from long distance and approach their intended targets to destroy them. In step two, a special electronic signal inside of each small unmanned aerial vehicle is sent to a cruise missile for guidance. And for the final step, the cruise missile that was guided by a small unmanned aerial vehicle hits and destroys its attack target. That is how the enemy's cruise missile system operates. Small unmanned aerial vehicles and cruise missiles are both launched from the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Once launched, they are operated from the heavy command cruiser via remote control. Our Joint Chiefs of Staff have drawn up a plan to destroy the enemy's missile system based on these analysis results. In order to conquer the heavy command cruiser, a constant barrage of attacks from the air is absolutely indispensable. First, we need to get a springboard to launch our plan of attack. We're about to head south to retake Cavalia Air Force Base in San Loma. Our objective is to retake Cavalia's air facilities, then establish a front line to destroy the enemy's missile system. Once the runway is secured, we should have a decent chance of taking out the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Enemy forces will be heavily deployed from land, air, and sea. We'll be doing all we can to deal with them, but I'm sure they'll be ready for us. Success or failure of this mission will very likely have a significant effect on the war. Put everything you've got into this one. So, yeah, I apologize if you guys hate the briefings, but I know some of these people watching, some of you people watching, I apologize, are watching for the story, and I will not skip that for you. But, uh, yeah, anyway, we're going to go establish a front line so we can destroy their missile system because it destroys things horribly. And also, I bought, um, at least I did before the off-camera, it didn't save, obviously, but I bought one of these beasts. And let's buy this, because it'll be useful. Aw, oh, yeah. FA-18, let's go destroy some shit. And I will be carrying the air to ground. Well, my wingman will be carrying some air to air, I suppose. There we Time go. To take off. Let's get some. And I'm going to start here, because I've never started here before. I usually always start out at C, because uh, it's really fun. Well, let's do something new. And we're in the F-A-18, same aeroplane that, that the uh, good old Blue Angels use. I've been to lots of their air shows. Really awesome. If you ever get a chance anywhere in the world to go to a really cool air show, freaking go. It's amazing. Of San Screw you, tanks! Screw you! Look at the tank warfare down there. What's the range on these? They suck. I thought it was a lot longer than this. Nah, I'm gonna do some stunts here. If I die, then I die. There we go. Okay. Preparing to. Wow. Never mind. Gonna engage us. Now I'm, I'm gonna save those. That's dumb to waste some of that. These. Hey, hey. Right. This thing's a little bit more agile than I am used to. Whatever. I'm gonna get you, APC. Go get them. Oh, there's air. Okay. Oh, just a hell. Okay, get some Shamrock. Aw, oh, yeah. What? Hey. 
Get it! It's a helicopter! Enemy chopper down. Okay, cool. But yeah, air show is amazing. If you ever get the chance, seriously. Okay, get it, Shamrock. Get it. Okay, I'm gonna try some low range. Low range, well. Wow. Low altitude strafing. Target hit. Of awesome. And I guess I just hit that tank like I knew. Okay. Enemy chopper shot down. Shut up, I don't wanna pull up. Heat. Yes. Oh, I love agile aeroplanes. They're my favorite. They're my favorite in the whole world. So strafing. Very fun. Okay. Well, the C. One was a little bit more exciting than this one to start out, but oh wells, what are you gonna do, right? Go get him, Shamrock. This one's mine. This is Shamrock and I will later on in the game get into a air to ground, like primarily air to ground vehicle, yes. and show you how that works, because it those are real fun too. Oh no, I destroyed some Humvees. What? Right. Okay, I gotta give him room or else I won't have any room to engage him. These things air brakes work real well. Actually quite nice. <laughs> he was flying faster than Almost me. Even though he really shouldn't have been. And no, it's not simply because oh he was in a in a helicopter. Nice he was like straight and level, which was weird. Don't know why it targeted things like that, but it did. Target hit. Ah. Ah. Uh oh. Okay, I could very easily die here. So he launched that. Oh, that was close! I'm fine. Oh shit! I lied. Don't shoot me! Okay, well this makes the commentary more exciting for me. I don't know if you guys really liked my panicked-ness. But, uh, it's fun for me to do this, so... That's what I'm gonna do. I love just getting real close to the ground. I don't know where that one's going. Okay. I'm gonna kill those Sam sites. They're killing me, man. Whoa, there's a cool rocket launchers. I love air to ground so much. It's easily one of my favorite. Now let's go and engage the ships out there, because that should be pretty fun, too. Well, I just looked at my computer screen and thought that I had forgot to hit the record button and almost panicked. That would have been bad. Oh, what the? Oh! Oh! That was horrible. I have no idea that... I was not expecting an anti-aircraft gun because, well, it wasn't on my freaking radar. Shut your face. Those are x -Amps. Son of a bitch! Oh my god, there's so many! There's so many! Stop it! Okay. I can't really fuck around here. Unfortunately. And then now there's these cruise missile things going down. Oh, look at all the AA and those things. Oh, goodness. Oh, 
Do you? We want to always do everything all the time. Look at all the missiles on the radar down there, bottom left. Ridiculous. Those might hit me. That one's gonna come in too high. Hopefully. Oh shit, look at all that air to air up there. Oh, F2s. Those are air to ground or air to. Well, ship, ground, whatever, same thing. That one should have it. Or not. Shut your face. Kill it! Kill it with fire! Okay, well let's uh, hurry our ass over to the other objective then, or not? Okay, that works. So all those targets were apparently still active when I was flying over them. Makes sense. I just wish I could at least kind of see them in my freaking radar, but I couldn't. So that's why it kind of destroyed me. All the SAM sites and stuff. Really don't know why I'm attacking a factory. Except for just points and also fuel. I don't know where those are coming from. Oh, there they are. Uh. Stop it! Stop! Think you're cool? Oh shit! First mission failed on the eighth one. I think it'll uh, it'll give me a restart from the mission update. Hopefully. If not, I'll cut to that um progress in the mission. But it did cut. To it. I still have 85 damage though, so it's not really too forgiving. So that's that's okay, I suppose. Anyway, I am going to target the sands those destroy and that's an airfield I believe and those targets are still on the runway so that would be an, a good idea to attack right now too really? Kill the drones I really don't know how that uh, anti-air lasted. I don't know where that mist is coming from. That's always good. Hopefully there's not an aircraft tower. I mean, you know, flight tower. I guess a hitbox is pretty good, because I really shouldn't have hit that. No idea where that's coming from. Please don't hit me! I don't really even know where those missiles went, but as long as they kill things. Okay, well let's uh allied attack do stuff. Oh. That's overkill on those destroyers. Oops, wrong button. Sorry, guys. I was uh, pressing the back button to switch my weapons. That's gonna hit me. Enemy cruiser sent under. Damn straight. That's coming from. Oh gosh! Oh fuck! Stop it! 
All targets are almost destroyed. Garuda one, take care of what's left. I'm working on it, but there's so many up. missiles. Fuck you, cruiser. That's right. Okay, well, now it shouldn't be too bad. Should have a lock any second now. And allied attack. Screw you guys. Oh, and there they go. Oh, this guy's close. Come here. Okay. I want to fight. Yay, we did it. Oh, here's my guy. All targets are confirmed destroyed. We have taken over the city of Sanoma. Yes. Let's go out for a few when we get back. Drinks are on me tonight. I'm sorry. Talisman, we just took control of our airport from the Estevakians. The battle for Ameria has just begun. That probably would have killed me. Mission, oh, well. We Hope you guys enjoyed this cruiser. mission, because... Excellent job. A lot more interesting. A lot more. Mainly because I was scared shitless. But whatever. Whatever works, right? Here's the day Mission briefing. accomplished. We have managed to retake Cavalia Air Force Base and free San Loma in the process. Cavalia will be our chief base of operation for conquering the enemy's heavy command cruiser. Ultimately, the enemy's cruise missile system cannot be stopped unless their heavy command cruiser is destroyed first. Every minute counts for us here. Wait for your next order concerning this operation. Okay, but yeah. Did pretty good, an A overall. It may have been an S if I didn't get so damaged. Not sure how they go about the ratings as far as damage that you take, but anyway. Our car has died directly under an aerial battle. The engine managed to get us this far, but it's been destroyed by machine gun fire. This pilot is from Ludmilla's homeland. She asks the crashed pilot about a name, asking if he has any information, but the pilot takes a turn for the worse. Just before all this, he seemed to be mumbling a name. Garuda. He's the one that shot me down. I know exactly what she's going through, why she's overcome with such emotion. My husband could have very well ended up like this. And now I know. The one she loves is a pilot as well. As we save a man's life on this wide open plane, we both begin to realize what we share, how much we have in common. But yeah, anyway, oh, I got one of my favorite planes too, yes. Anyway, that was Mission 8. I hope you guys enjoyed the set, and join me next time. Hopefully it'll be as exciting as this one. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.